Okay, hey guys, what's up? Um, I'm probably gonna break this down. I don't know if it'll be back to back, but it's just a series of videos to kind of clarify the situation I'm in. But there's the first couple of videos are just gonna be informative, and you know, this is a lot of information that you can go out and Google, ask Google. Um, first and foremost, the uh, um, in if you watch the full series, the videos all the videos in order um you'll actually understand what i'm getting at um okay the first topic i want to cover is uh for this video s sofa agreements what is a sofa agreement you say hmm it sounds strange for but honestly um in layman terms a uh, sofa agreement stands well sofa the acronym sofa stands for status of forces agreement which pretty much it gives you the do's and don'ts, the cans and um, can'ts and within countries. Sorry if it's bad English in here. This is not scripted, um, but essentially, um, this pretty much um, is an agreement established between two countries. Um, you know, as a soldier, you know, as a United States citizen and a soldier, um, pretty much. I fall underneath uh, in being stationed in Germany. This pretty much lays out the guidelines of my rights and what's possible and what's not possible. So status of force agreement is definitely important in terms of political and international relationships. But in regards to um, family, it's definitely very important, especially if a service member, you as a service member or a service member, um, service member or um, uh, fiance or dependent of a service member or family member of service members. SOFA comes into play because in the case that it's a U.S. soldier and a U.S. civilian, um, if you do not already have, uh, if you do not, um, have a SOFA stamp in your passport, then what that pretty much translates to is that you can come to the country like typical visa you can come to the country but within 90 days before 90 you exceed 90 days you need to depart the country and as um some of you may be aware um you can't really come in and out and in and out i'm gonna leave for a week and then i'll be back i mean financially i wouldn't financially that makes no sense whatsoever but that's the major important aspect of the sofa stamp it allows um U.S. soldiers um, to bring their um, U.S. soldiers and I guess DOD um, civilians to um, bring their dependents with them on overseas tours. So this is very important and um, I encourage everybody to um, just read up on it. It's it's something that's very important and um, particularly in particular as this series of videos goes on, um, I give you a uh, breakdown of why it's so important but yes the sofa agreement the do's and don'ts what you can and what you can't can't do it's pretty much you know the agreement between your government and another government um in a nutshell but it's very important and in the next video hopefully i get to why if not it'll happen all right guys catch you later